Hey guys, what's happening? So, just picked this up on Amazon. It's the uh, Arch Oil Kit. So, if you actually have a, a Ford 7.3 or 6.0 with Hue injectors, you definitely need to run this stuff. Uh, I've been running it for about 40,000 miles, and my truck has been running great ever since. But So, originally, um, my truck has 200,000 miles now, but I, I started getting some stiction around like like 165,000 miles, maybe like 170, I can't remember. And, uh, but I've always actually run like, like diesel, like diesel cleaner and, you know, like, like a lubricant for the injectors, but I actually have factory injectors, 200,000 miles. I'll show you that too. And I'll, I'll log into my IDS, my 40 IDS, and I'll show you uh, an injector, uh, you know, run like an injector like scan, what's it called, like a, I can't remember, I'll come back, I'll show you. But uh, let me show you this stuff. So this is actually the new kit, so, before I was running the, uh, they had a, oh, I forget it was like Aegis, I can't remember the specific, I'll go back into Amazon where I bought it and I'll show you the cool new features of this stuff, the kit, diesel fuel system cleaner, so, um, I mean, from what I can see so far, it looks like they, shows that it reduces a lot of carbon, and that's actually a major issue with some of these power strokes is, um, I live in California, so I had to get my truck smogged, um, so I can't remove my EGR valve, and that's always an issue. You know, you're sending carbon back into your intake, and back into your intake stream. All right. So yeah, because because it's also a uh, it's not being cooled like you know with a it's also a direct injection. So it's not being like your typical car, you know, that has a fuel injector, you know, right above the intake valve. It keeps the intake valve valves clean, but any direct injection engine has an issue with the carbon buildup on the intake valves. So hopefully this will fix it or at least help with it I don't think it's gonna, it's not gonna solve it but okay look at professional injector turbo engine DPF EGR cleaner so that's cool I mean if it works um, all right so I'm actually gonna be running a t6 I always run synthetic oil I live in Southern California so I don't need the 1540 the, the thicker stuff um, or excuse me it's the opposite <laughs> 1540 would be for a uh, uh, for hot climates, uh, 540, colder climates. Um, but I've always actually run this. It gives you better fuel mileage. You know, the thinner the oil, the better the fuel mileage. But like I said, ever since I've been running this stuff, it's been great. Uh, like I said, I had a slight, slight uh, stiction on my injector when it was cold. And this immediately cleared it up. And that was years, a couple years ago by now. So, eliminates four power stroke, 6 liter and 7.3 injector problems. And yes, it does. Stuff's great. Um, let me go back into the, uh, I'll go into Amazon, I'll show you what it, they're claiming it's supposed to do. Alright, so here is the kit that I bought on Amazon. And like I was saying, well before I had actually run the, uh, they changed, I guess I created a diesel formula, the AR6500 right here. Uh, because before, I still actually have the AR6200, and that's actually what I currently run. So it looks like they maybe made a more diesel specific. Not sure. Um. But this is actually the stuff I remember before, the AR6400. So it's supposed to fix that and decarbon the uh, turbo. Um, was it like a DPF or, yeah, okay. Uh, all right, we'll give this a shot. So I'm gonna put uh, 12 quarts of uh, the uh, T6 in there and uh, top it off and we'll get it go. We'll go back into um, Ford IDS, and I'll show you the uh, injectors. Right, so I've always been super paranoid about this truck. So I do actually have one of those magnetic drain plugs, uh, Mishimoto. Um, but it always does pick up a little bit. I mean, really tiny little bit, and that's good. You know, it's probably going to be most likely, uh, it's not going to be bearing material. It'll probably be like a uh, ring. Before you put your drain plug back on, make sure you, uh, there's probably going to be about a quarter well in here. It's going to drain back so you can pull the filter out. There's a drain plug in there. That's going to go down. There we go. Yeah, this has been covered a million times before, but only use Motocraft oil filters. Yeah, surprisingly, they, they actually have these at Walmart, so there are very few Motocraft they do. Alright, so it looks like uh, you don't have to put the whole bottle in. So one 12 inch bottle sweeps 40 gallons. I probably have about a half take in there, so probably about 13 gallons. So I'll probably end up putting about a third of this in there. 
I think I'll add this too. Alright, so eBay VCM clone. Factory injectors, 200,000, 86 miles. Alright. Alright, there's the power balance test right there. So, 200,000 miles. Factory uh, injectors. It's pretty incredible. Like I was saying, I actually was having a stiction on uh, number three at one point. But, alright guys, cool. Arch oil, man. The bomb.